Good morning beautiful people. I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, psychic medium and divine channeler. This is the Daily Twin Flame reading. Please bear in mind that as a rule I tend to read where the Divine Masculine is at and the messages coming through from the Divine Masculine. In no way, shape or form am I saying that this journey is one-sided as I 100% know it isn't. I also know I have a lot of Divine Masculines watching so please do switch DM to DF if that resonates with your journey. Okay, so we're going to use, I've just seen the box, oh, I don't know where it is, the Journey of Love cards. Anyway, because they're the ones I'm drawn to use today. So let's see what we need to know today. Doo -doo -doo. Simplicity. Stop overcomplicating things. But that really feels more what the Divine Masculine is, where he's coming from. But it's a message for you too as well. I feel like the Divine Masculine is maybe trying to plan a bit too much. Trying to figure out things a bit too much. And needs to take that step back to simplifying things. Because... I feel like that's what they're doing. It's, I need to take a step back, concentrate on the connection. The connection, which when life gets too busy, you lose sight of, you know it's there, you can feel it, but you lose sight of it because the connection at the end of the day is the most important part of this journey. It is connection which spans time space, realms sometimes. There is no distance too big to weaken the connection. There is no time and space which can weaken the connection. Your connection is massively strong, unbreakable and will never lessen. It feels like the pull of that connection. I can feel it in my chest. It's like the pull to you, Divine Feminine, is so, so strong. And thinking about the journey in simple ter terms, not worrying about how it's going to work out in the future, not worrying about the hows, the whens, the wheres, but just feeling feeling the connection, feeling the moments you've shared, feeling the love which is there between you. It really feels like the Divine Masculine is just taking a step back and doing exactly that and feeling that love be pulled to you because the bond is unbreakable. No matter what is going on, on around and outside the journey. The bond is there and it is unbreakable. It is real. It is pure. And I feel like the Divine Feminine just needs to do the same as what the Divine Masculine is doing today and step back into the feelings feel that pure unconditional love which envelopes your soul which envelopes your body it's not just your heart that feels it it's your whole being that feels it your divine masculine is really feeling that today connecting with that you can feel emotions which are coming to the surface as well because the connection is so unconditional, is so strong. Is it not overwhelming? Brings those tears of joy. Like, oh my God, I never thought I would love somebody like this and I never thought somebody would love me like this. And the realization of that takes a little bit of processing, feeling, and actually getting your head round because your heart knows, but your head has to catch up. 
And that's where the Divine Masculine feels like they are today. Just feeling all the emotions which come with the love. The good emotions, the tears of joy. We then have the bride offers herself. I feel like she stood there and she's like that. Arms open wide, heart open, ready for the Divine Masculine. And I actually feel that the Divine Masculine being in this still place where they're simplifying everything can feel that energy more today. Can really truly feel the depth of that love. It's powerful when you feel the feelings and get out of your head. That is really where the power of this connection comes in to its own. It's powerful. And we've also got the intimacy card because you don't need to be physically intimate to feel the intimacy of this journey of your connection. I know that's what will happen when you're in physical union, but feel the feelings now, feel your heart racing, feel that love just taking over because that's what your divine masculine is doing. And it, it feels very much like it's bringing the energy back to the core, bringing the energy back to source where it's meant to be because we've lost sight with life going on, of the true connection, the true feelings. You know they're there, but how often do you allow yourself the time to feel them? And then we've got the lover's card. Because this love is meant to be. This love is beautiful. This love is meant to be. We've got the rings of time. No matter the time and space, the right time to be in union will happen. Everything is a part of the divine plan. Trust in that divine timing because it is only a matter of time before you have that physical union. Feel that love. Feel the power. Feel the passion, feel the intimacy, feel all those feelings that there's no words that can describe them. Just sit with that for a little bit today. Connect telepathically, energetically with your twin and grow those feelings. Thank you so very much for joining me. Please do like and comment on the video if you feel drawn. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. I truly do appreciate each and every single person supporting the channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Please do take care, stay safe and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Namaste. Bye.